Oh, uh, can someone send me something to chat so I can test something? Oh, thank you, Sparks. That's really nice of you. Uh, by the way, she wrote your mother. Now, let's test again. All right, so it's working. Tyler, you don't have to worry about uh, message noises, you know. Ding, ding, ding. Unless uh, Luis makes them. Exactly. Ding. I'm going to do that randomly during the podcast. He's going to be so fucking <laughs> pissed. <laughs> <laughs> so, what I gather here... By the way, TJ, have you finished your pizza? Maybe. <laughs> Okay, I don't think so. Uh, what does it taste like? Like, what is it made of? Uh, ingredients. Go fuck yourself, TJ. <laughs> See, Sparks, what I told you, I'm gonna have to go there exactly. and punch you in the throat. I, I want it recorded and, and on video. Uh, well, you can't do that in Florida, so screw you guys. What? I'm going home. What, punch people in the throat? Well, A lot that crazy either. Stuff happens. I, I'm pretty sure, you know, generally... If you punch anybody in the throat anywhere, they could charge you with assault, so... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not allowed anywhere. Right, but that's not the craziest thing that happens in hey, Florida. Hey, communists, Russia. You don't punch throat. Throat punches you. <laughs> Specifically, Unless... Vladimir Putin's throat punches you. Yeah. Unless, you know, you're fighting Genghis Khan for your pizza. That sounds like he's putting you into his pl into your place. Aww. Yeah, we can start. I can eat my pizza quick. between... Making quirky comments. Hey! <laughs> I was ac I was actually using the uh, adjective, not your name. <laughs> God. Yeah. Uh, God, this is so punniful. <laughs> well, <laughs> before we start hey, with the pun attacks. Hey, Bob or Dunkelman's coming to Australia. I get what? to meet her. Yeah. Nice. I'm chilling. We haven't even started yet, and this podcast is already going down under. Oh. <sighs> Podcast. I'm Luis, aka Sparnsolov, and today we have Nicholas Cage, aka TJ1023, uh, Dr. Sparks, and Dom Toretto, aka Quirky. You know, I think I've already used Nicholas Cage, TJ. Yeah, I think I think you did. I have. Yes. Shame I'm on pretty you. Sure. All right, fuck it. Restart the entire podcast. You should start trying to you know more historical characters, like Genghis. Nicholas Khan. Cage is historical. Well, I mean, I mean he, he found the secret back. treasure lost by the American government for thousands of years. Yes, thousands. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yes, thousands. And Don't I mean, he stole the Declaration of Independence. That's historical. Is it, though? Um, yeah. Well, like, historically stupid. <laughs> Everything in Hollywood is true. Obviously. Like, there's a cave kidding. in uh, the <laughs> South Dakota president's face. Is, uh, my mind is going. There's a cave in the president's faces. No, the thing in the <laughs> monument in South Dakota. You, you mean um, Mount Rushmore? Mount Rushmore? Rush, Rush, yes! Oh my gosh, I can't believe and that. And I'm Two people who don't live in the US knew that. Okay, my mind is like <laughs> gone right now. Uh, you want some time to run after it? No. Yeah. I figure it's it's like left the country. <laughs> It's kind of like a cat, you know, comes and goes. Yeah. When it wants yeah. to come home, it's there. <laughs> yeah, but sometimes it scratches at the door and it gets annoying. Meows, meows at 3 o'clock in the morning. Hungry. Yeah. Bucks you across oh. the face with a baseball bat trying to get <laughs> you up to feed it. My sure. cat greets me every morning with a, the song of his people. Uh, like every morning without fail. <gasps> meowing at my door. That? Cause cats sound yeah, like imagine that, that, but like higher pitched and you know more pathetic. Like a cat. Okay. <laughs> like a cat. Yeah. There's actually no. That's actually that's no. that's actually that's a bad noise. I think we have a, we have a cat outside it. of our apartment. Yeah, outside of our apartment that wants to come in. I don't know whose it is, but it wants to come in our apartment all the time. And it was meowing at three o'clock in the morning outside my sister's place. Like, no, we can't let you in, man. So I know the sound of the. Uh, cats people. 
Uh, and a uh, word of advice for anybody who plans on getting a cat. Unless you plan on, you know, feeding them wet food all the time, you know, canned wet cat food, uh, never feed it to them at all. Like, my, it, it, yeah. it's all or nothing. Yeah, my cat just eats dry biscuits and nothing else. Yeah, if, if you ever feed that cat wet cat food, it will never get, like... It, it I, only eats it if she's really, really hungry. So they get Wait, spoiled. So your cat prefers wet, prefers dry yeah. food? Yeah. Oh, that's like the opposite of every it's cat I've ever had experience with. Yeah, <laughs> it's down under. It's, it's upside like down. His uh, his stomach acids like you know spin in the other direction. It's like oh, can only have dry food. <laughs> you know, rotation of the earth. Right. Uh, of course, CJ. But hey, uh, before we started, we were talking about the free uh, Forza Horizon 2 DLC. I'm playing it right, right now. Yeah, I downloaded that yesterday. I haven't played it yet because I've been busy with Assassin's Creed. But it's... Of course. You know, free stuff is the best stuff. It is. I did go through, like, the one of the most stupid uh, first world problems the other day. Yesterday, yeah, actually. Got cut off. No, not really. Uh, you know, I keep plugging the Outworld Inhabitants company and the Outworld games. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, they released the like the reboot they made. Yeah, the new one. Yeah. Yeah, the new and tasty. They released it on Friday. And so I was I am still really fucking excited for that game. And I went to buy it. But here's the thing. I don't have a credit card of my own. So I use someone else's. And Use PayPal? Huh? PayPal. It goes directly from your bank account. Oh, really? That's an option? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Just, uh, oh, okay. You have to add it on the 360, though. It doesn't do it for the one. Uh, for the one adding the option. Or you can do oh. it through the website. I'm bone then. Wait, but, the 360, uh, the one doesn't have PayPal? Uh, 360 it, does? It, it, um, it, no, you can enter it on the 360. You can't enter it on the one. But if you have it as an option, it'll come up on the one. That's kind of odd. Yeah, that's yeah, weird. my 360 doesn't have internet connection. Shit. But anyway. I just use the um, website, xbox.com. Hmm. Shout out to Microsoft. Yeah, I'll look into that, but here's the thing. Uh, so I was really excited to play that. And so I used someone else's credit card and pay that person in cash. You know, it's fine. But they had to make a big purchase the other day. And so the credit card is like credit maxed card out. So I can't use it to buy the fucking game. And it's going to take forever until I can do it. It was like I had the hugest gaming boner I've had in like the last 10 years. And it just went limp in 10 seconds. <laughs> oh, please. Quite, quite oh, the you know, metaphor. The, the, most, uh, <laughs> recent, <laughs> the most recent gaming boner that I've had. I uh, was playing the Final Fantasy 15 demo. Oh my god. It's so pretty. Like seriously, if if you're a massive fan of Final Fantasy, you need to get Final Fantasy Type-0 and get the Final Fantasy 15. Uh, it's only on the Xbox One though, so sorry. Uh, you people who didn't get the Xbox One. Who don't care? Yeah, you <laughs> don't care. <laughs> but, oh my god, it's so awesome. I could go on about it, but I won't because apparently it's boring to some people. Uh, oh no, I've, I've only played I don't care Final about Fantasy the Xbox One. No. no, I'm talking about Final Fantasy. Oh, I know. Oh, now, one. Sparks, why don't you care about the Xbox One? Like, do you hate it, or no. would you write in, into battle? No. Okay, what? so the thing about video games, I'm about like seven years behind on video games, and I bought the Xbox 360 two years ago. So, yeah, right before the one oh. came out. So I've got I a lot see. to catch up on. Yeah, I still have some stuff to catch up on, the 360, so are, but... Uh, are you, like, trying to, like, shotgun all the games you never played? Kind of. I like, uh, I bought it with... Yeah, I bought it from a friend with, like, a bunch of games that came with it. So I'm trying to actually finish all of those games before I buy new ones. But, of course, that's not working. I'm a bit addicted to Lego games, so I bought a bunch of those. So, Wow. I can't yeah. imagine trying to catch up on video games the way I 
catch up on TV shows. It doesn't work oh. the same way. Uh, I imagine not. Real quick. No, it doesn't really. But speaking of TV shows, Netflix Australia got launched this week. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. I yeah. think we Fingers. got Netflix before Australia. Wow. Yeah, but do you have, wow. do you have the, a better um, uh, library than us? I'll lead uh, I have no fucking idea. I don't have Netflix. What? Oh, do you guys oh, have a limited you... library? Uh, no, we actually don't because we can use um, a thing on our Chrome extension, which actually makes... Because they didn't change the price from the US account price to the... Um, the Australian price that didn't uh, like do the currency exchange. Oh my god, it's raining. Um, so, so it's actually cheaper than the US uh, version at the moment. And plus, if you use a VPN, you can access the um, US library, and it's technically legal because you have paid for an account. Oh, nice. So, yeah. So we get the. I mean, in general, yeah. it seems kind of silly to have different libraries for different countries. It's it's cool I mean, licensing, TJ. It's yeah. It's I, I could get. I know. Go on about licensing the video game thing, ones. Licensing thing. Yeah, I can but... go. I can go on about the video game ones. All day. I can go on about the Australian ratings, classification board being shit yeah. and run by the government. Uh, Australia seems, you know, kind of crazy about that kind of stuff. Uh, like only we only just got the R eighteen plus rating like a year ago. Oh, so you guys still... can actually have mature games. No, not really. Or do they still, still get, get censored? Can't... Yeah, they still get censored. Like Saints Row 4, you know the anal probe thing? Yeah. The weapon? That's cut out of the Australian version. Yeah, they talked oh, wow. about that on Wait, the patch. In Mortal Kombat, when people get hit, instead of blood, do Mortal they Kombat spill, got like, banned rainbows? in Australia. Banned from sale. It got refused classification until the R18 Plus rating came out. Damn. Man, mm. those guys are just so... Wow. Oh, uh, by the way, do so you guys butthurt. hear any background get noise from me? Haha. probe. Ha. What are we... Do you guys hear any background noise from me? Oh, Not really. I smell rain. Okay. No. No, I don't. You can smell rain in Brazil. Well, it no, does I, rain it, here, it just, Sparks. Hey, do you guys hear I, I anything? <laughs> I smell rain. <laughs> kind of focusing I on the wrong sense there, Quirky. <laughs> the sun oh, no, smells too it loud. Just, it, like, it literally <laughs> just rained, like, like five seconds before. You know, and what now does you that have to do with drizzle. background noise in Luis? Yeah, and like, I could how smell can you my smell rain? Brazilian rain? How nobody ask you about your smell? Yeah, Quirky, yeah. I, I don't want to know how you smell. Like, this is this is a perfect example where you can use the phrase "What does that have to do with the price of tea in China?" I don't. I've never heard that phrase. Is that a yeah? Is that a thing? I think it might be that, American. That, I don't know. Yeah, it, it might be. But does it have to do with flinging tea into the Boston Harbor? <laughs> I don't think <laughs> sure. so. Does it, it have anything by to the do English. with the, the, the British colonization? What about the of Dutch trading company? Some, oh, well, well, you you just went robot. I... Did I? Yeah. Yeah. Am I still? Actually, do I still I sound it... like a robot? No. Oh wow! I'm check- looking at your connection. It is. It was like way up there for a second. Oh, your base are belong to us. Nothing. No. Yeah, it's, it's going back there. down. It's going back down. You're Fuck. at twenty percent loss. I get knocked back down, but up up again. Which yeah, is a lot. Yeah, keep me down. You're gonna I get, get knocked, knocked down. down, but I get up again. I up again. And we should yeah, stop because of copyright keep... stuff. Yeah. Damn it. Pissing the night away. Did, did we ever find did anybody ever find out like um what the deal was with that? You know, how we were talking about a couple podcasts ago? Uh-huh. About uh, singing on YouTube. Uh it yeah, doesn't count. It didn't look I thought it. covers it's were technically okay. a cover. Because it's technically a cover yeah. and apparently those don't get <laughs> those don't get a fringe thing, so they don't now, but the reason uh we brought it up, I don't know if you guys listened to that podcast. We were talking about um I think it was the John Tron or Game Grumps guys, they were singing and they were like, oh, we can't sing because of new YouTube rules. But oh, there's new YouTube rules? Apparently there were, I don't know, they were saying, oh, there are new YouTube rules that literally nobody else knows about except for us, apparently. But I don't, I don't know, I don't, think that's, I don't think that's going to happen because, you know, covers, <laughs> people still make covers and stuff, so. Yeah. Although I, I mean, if see the something artist weird. has a problem with it, sure. Is it? Like if it would a... be illegal to like um, cover a song written by like another band and then try and sell it as your own, right? Yeah. Yes. Like, yeah, that's probably. Well, is that even if you uh, attributed it to the original artist? Wouldn't you have to pay royalties? 
Um, I don't know. I think you have to like get into agreement with them and then you can make that cover and sell it for your own, but you have to like say it's theirs. Yeah. I, I was just curious because I, I was uh, looking at random random like songs the other day and I found I came across, you know, every time you type in a song in YouTube, you're going to find a couple covers and I looked at some of those and there was this girl who was singing like, um, it was Monster by Imagine Dragons and um, like she didn't link to like their, you know, the original song or anything like that. She just said, Imagine Dragons by YouTube name and I'm like, you know, isn't that all copyrighted? Could you uh, not be selling this? If she's selling it, are you a cop, it, TJ? She probably has <laughs> some sort of licensing going. Am I a what? Are you a cop? You gotta tell me if you are. <laughs> <laughs> that, it's that's, a rule. That's not a real law. <laughs> I, I don't have to tell you crap. But, but, but I'm you... not a cop. Just trust me. Trust me. How would you Wait, know that, Laurie? If you're trust. not a cop, cop. <laughs> uh, I'm not. I'm not a cop. I'm a lawyer. There's a difference. Oh, oh big great! Difference. So I can make lawyer jokes now. Yes. Do you have lawyer jokes? Like I, lawyer yeah, jokes are oh, a I thing. Imagine. Yes. I, I'm sure. I'm sure there's like a you know huge relation between <laughs> Why lawyers you call and lawyers. Thousand lawyers under the sea. A good start. Boom. Things like okay. that. Oh, what? What? He wants to murder a thousand lawyers. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh! By the way, on an unrelated yeah. note, you are under arrest for D, but one. totally not by me because I'm totally not a cop. But yeah. I'm I'm gonna have if you guys want me to tell it, I'm gonna have to translate it like right now. So do it, do it, okay, do it, I, I'm do gonna try. It, do it, do it. Do so it. I'm I'm doing it. Shut up. So uh, an engineer dies, and. Aww. Calm down, Sparks. <laughs> RT, if you cry every time. Yeah. So an engineer dies, and then he goes to heaven, and his name is not on the list, so he's sent to hell. And then there, he's greeted by the devil, and the devil's like, "Oh, welcome to hell. You're fucking boned here." And and then he's like, "Wait, I'm an engineer. I can improve this shit." And then, in a matter of months, he installs air conditioning and uh, like. Oh, those small stairs, I forgot the name of those. Cerberus? What? Or Not like or... the escalators. Oh, I thought you said monsters. No, mall stairs. Oh, mall? Oh, the mall. Okay. okay. Well, anyway. Yeah. That's... Escalators, air conditioning, uh, pools, all that shit. Like, he improves hell a lot. And then, they get a message from heaven, and it's like... Uh, we made a mistake. He is not supposed to go there, so he needs to come back. Otherwise, we'll sue you. And then the devil replied yeah. the message. Well, I want to see you try to find a lawyer there. Yeah. Ba Boom. <laughs> hey. <laughs> just, just out of curious, like the whole engineer thing seemed kind of unrelated. Like, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> it's well, like so. This guy was an engineer. He made hell a better place. <laughs> By the way, heaven. If you try to sue us, we have a lot of lawyers. Right. <laughs> There's yeah, a lot of losses well, in, in uh, some stuff might have gotten lost in translation. I, I'll admit to that. Well, you know, we got the gist. I'm no, that's the joke. It's that's the joke. Yeah, that that sounds about right. I'm just saying the person who made the joke just seems a little pointless. Your face is pointless. Just like your hey! face. Oh, because you know damn. you're not a sword. So kind of round. Don't, I don't know. Don't I, I I I think point. I look rather sharp if you ask me. Oh, yeah, but but you're not a triangle jelly. or like a square or anything. I, hey, it's I am hip an, to be a square. I'm an overloid. Fun fact: skulls are round. They do have points, though. What? Yeah, like in random places, you get like the points that yeah, like, where like your cheekbones join. And, yeah, and, and well, your, your your nose hole, your nose cavity. Yeah, too. that's a triangle. That's pointy. I mean, there is a pointy part Who in the nose knows? hole. This stuff, by the way. God. Shut up, Quirky. Hey, Quirky, get the fuck out of here. Okay, that's me done. Have a nice day, everybody. Do, 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 that's Quirky. Everyone, thank you so much for listening. Quirky, just no. <laughs> well, that was fast. Well, apparently, apparently, uh, last time I was on, we broke the sensor limit. <laughs> for, for the sensor <laughs> record for the uh, most amount of sleeps in a podcast, I think it was. 
Or at yeah. least for the um at least for our podcast. But um Yeah, it was the last time we were here, right? There was a whole I, lot of bleeping. Yeah. Like the word um bleep bleep. Word oh, bleep. by the way, just did, because did he you said uh yeah. Guess actually do, do you just want Tyler to put like an actual bleep over that so people think it's something? Yeah. I don't even okay. remember what was bleeped. Uh, <laughs> Neither do uh, I. I can tell. I mean, I can, it must not I have been that offensive. Type it in the chat. I we... <laughs> no, no, no. I am going to say it because Tyler's going to bit over. He's going to beep over all the beeps anyway. And I'll actually be able to hear it. Yeah. So the word <laughs> was bleeped because Tyler doesn't like that. <laughs> what? Oh. Wait, but isn't, isn't that like the thing with the British? Like they just like to say the word <laughs> No, that's no, Scottish that's people. Irish. Oh. No, that's Scottish. No, no, no. As, a, Scots. as a Brazilian Scottish? guy. Really? I don't give I don't give a shit about the word. Uh, I'm and not, then and then the know. second thing which TJ said was a nine eleven joke. Oh, yeah. it wasn't a joke so much as an analogy. Like, well, okay. Why why do people get offended by the word? I, because well, it means because vagina. It's 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 a, it's a well, harsh way to say it. You can call people dickheads, and you know. No one bleeps because that out. We laugh. We laugh at that, but nobody laughs when you say. Well, the I Scottish laugh. do. Well, maybe the Scottish people. Well, you know. I, okay. I, think I, because I don't, so don't care. care about the word. C- Apparently, that's a greeting just... in some places. In Australia, yeah, like, Australia is probably the only place <laughs> in the world where you call your friends c- and the people you don't know mates. Wow. <laughs> like this. Okay, that's, that doesn't quite work as uh, the whole, you're not my friend, bud. Yeah, well, we're Australian. We're tougher. So you're not a my <laughs> mate? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's like you, you, walk, you walk up to a drop bear and you're like, oh, what, wow. what are you doing, mate? And then like, yeah, you walk up to a friend we, and you're like, I don't up to a fat person in America and say, ooh. Wow. <laughs> Shots fired. Well, me to go on. That hurts my jelly belly. <laughs> <laughs> It's better, Jack. <laughs> That's right. I called you. You call him Jack. Yeah, his brother. His brother's. Because they sound Jack. the same. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. He sounds like his brother, but he's not as ragey. Oh, okay. I I get the joke. Yeah. I'm trying to think of. Yeah. S- that oh, takes oh. some explaining. Yeah, basically, it's just that TJ says that all all Australians oh, sound Tyler's the same. Tyler's gonna have a lot to bleep out. Yeah, oh Tyler's yeah. Gonna have a lot That's to why we kept have saying the words. Cunt. You know, so he, he asked for us to not have a lot for him to edit so he could enjoy his holiday. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Sorry, Sorry about this. Tyler. Uh, I'll blame Quirky. Yeah. I'll Xbox stop listening. Why? <laughs> Did it just search for the, <laughs> for the word cunt? <laughs> Your Xbox is like, you want me? I'll bash your fucking head and I will. No, if what I said Xbox. Yeah, it didn't say one of you, one of you want me IRL, mate. Yeah. I'm sorry, Tyler, but. Yeah. Fuck it. Right in the bleep. With your mother. Oh, and just okay. because I said I would do it. Ding! Ding! <laughs> ding! You know, because of the message. Tings. Yes, there yes. You go. We get it. I don't think it sounds the same. Sparks, come on. Yeah, Wait. it's more, it's more of a beep than a ting. Don't, don't say then that. I, it's it's like a yeah, ding. like ding. No, I, I I don't I don't think there's an ing ding. sound in it. It's like beep, ding, or or maybe like know. a beep with like a taper on the end. What? You know, like what? a taper, like beep. Or well, I no, guess it's mine's just, like, there it is. like a, that's like a depressed beep. Mine's like a honk. Who got a message? I guess like everybody's is different. It, it's like instead of our internet voice, we have the beep. Yeah. The beeps, the boops, and the bops. Bippity boppity boop. Onomatopoeias. Mm. Actually, isn't it alliteration? <laughs> no. Actually, that's. Actually, it's alliteration as well. Bippity boppity boop. Oh, yeah. Brings uh, us back quirky. to like English. Yeah. Your Class. face is in alliteration. I don't know. Quirky. Qu- oh, no, I can't say that word. <laughs> that that will definitely get bleeped. And now don't want to. Oh yeah, it, it, that will what? get bleeped. 
Never mind the last 15,000 bleeps. <laughs> I mean, assuming Quirky's they will be bleeped. Queer. Otherwise, that's Quirky's just awkward. Queer. Quirky's queer. Oh, and uh, Wyatt. I thought of this in the last uh, conversation we had. Uh, I found this on Reddit the other day. <laughs> it was pretty funny. What is it? It's a uh, pocket Bible. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you need Jesus is with you always. Do we want to like tell the audience what it says, or t- um, is Tyler gonna get mad? I no, uh, that, tell that's it, what I tell don't it, know. If it's we we could just put it in the link. I mean, I'll like, put, put it in a warning, warning. Oh, okay. shitter, okay. but put, put, a la- put a language warning. Uh, oh, okay. reminder for like, the future me: put the pocket Bible image on the link shitter. Also, you're a very cool guy. You're welcome. Also, uh, future Luis, uh, you still owe me five hundred bucks. Oh, well, best Luis says, Luis, "Fuck you, you still TJ." Owe me for that Xbox One Smite <laughs> Alpha code. Wait, Alpha? Wait, was that you I sent it to? No, you didn't send me a Smite code. Why didn't you send me a Smite code? Yeah, why didn't you send me a Smite code? No. Yeah, yeah. Dick. What? Because uh, I mean, you... I'll accept new and tasty codes, though. You know, <laughs> just <laughs> <laughs> I, I can. Really, I'm really frustrated about that, and it's the most Imagine stupid reason I've ever had to be frustrated about something. What? It's what? What? Not being able to to purchase new and tasty right now because of the credit card I think you'll, issue. I think Wait, you'll be fine. New and, what's new and tasty? It's the Odd World reboot. My dick. Oh. I don't think that, that's new that I've been or just tasty. talking like for the um. past months, like all of them. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Oh. So I just yeah. I actually had no idea what Odd World and New and Tasty was, so I just googled it and what the fuck am I looking at? Oh man, you're looking at like one of the best games I've played mm. in my childhood. I'm sure. Really, TJ? Like you've been on the podcast I talked about it. Where, I don't remember where, you ever talking you? about this. Did, did Holy you like? Shit. Do you like only talk about this on the podcast I'm not on? No, you were on. I think every single one of them. But fight, fight. I might have been making a beat at the time. Oh or my god! That looks kind of or fighting Genghis Khan. Or fighting Genghis Khan and getting killed by him. Well, at least if you were saving the world, but no, you're getting defeated. God damn it, TJ. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, on a semi-related note. Um, in my local Model UN, we are currently doing a North Korea, um, debate. Like, we're pretending to be the government of North Korea, and it's pretty fucking fun. That would be oh, interesting. Oh, please <laughs> tell me, please tell me, racist. Oh, we're, we're all the racist. Um, first of all, the, uh, chief military <laughs> guy, he's, uh, one of our friends, he's, a uh, Jewish, and, uh, we keep saying that he's the only Jew in North Korea. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's a little bit racist. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> uh, That's me. Sparks would say that everyone is a little bit of a <laughs> racist. Say a word. <laughs> Beep. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to give Tyler more work with this podcast <laughs> than we already have. He's probably Why? just gonna flip the table and walk away. Like, yeah. let's, let's not even tell him. Let's just have him find out on his own. <laughs> <laughs> that would be even worse. Because he would sit down, and you know how Tyler tries to edit like a whole podcast in one night. I can see him. He's just gonna be listening with his head in his hands, going, "Why? Why? <laughs> Please kill me now!" <laughs> oh my god. But hey, um, you guys want to do some questions? Yeah, let's do uh, some questions. Right? Just, sure. A little earlier. Wait, yeah. what time did we start? Well, I mean, we are. Uh, didn't we start at three o'clock or three five or something? Well, no. I mean that's when we were supposed to start, but I was getting pizza and stuff. Remember? Yeah, so we'll blame Luis or TJ. Yeah, it's it's always my fault. Yes. God damn it, TJ. I blame I blame Tucker. Tucker did it. I mean, we're uh. By the oh way, shit! Why why don't we talk about that? Red vs. Blue season thirteen's about to. Oh my gosh! Yeah, yes. we can talk about wait. that. Uh, just a, a heads up for the audience. It's just that we're trying to aim for shorter podcasts. Uh, oh, are we? You know, I mean, we it's are the last the crew, ones have been like super long. 
Well, well, you know, it, it doesn't mean we're gonna do a short podcast all the time. It's just that they were getting too long, and due to popular demand and you know suggestions, we're trying to work things out a bit. And Tyler complaining and okay, no, no, endless. not really. Um, yeah, yeah, Tyler complained. Oh, he like sat in the corner. He was on his phone. He was, you know, talking to the prime the minister. Corner. Talking to the Prime Minister on his little, and the queen. His little British phone. And, and the Queen. The Queen was there, too. They, <laughs> his they, British phone, which is different from they, all they the other phones. They were on a conference phones. call, man. They were on a conference call. No, and then Vladimir actually... Putin was, like, in the background, like, why, don't, why do you hate me? My country is awesome. I am Vladimir yeah. Putin. We, we actually uh, talked about it, like, the four of us, so... Okay. Yeah, so... Don't worry, guys. If you guys want us to do longer podcasts, I'm sure we could accommodate somehow. Yeah. I mean, like, by the way, you know, that's... Uh, kind of stick picks. I'm maybe, not maybe we'll, trying... You do something for us, we do something for you. I'm not trying scratch to my go... Back. I scratch yours. A little, little bit of that. A <sighs> little, little bit of help, you know, coming our way, um, maybe? TJ, please, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's actually that's something funny. that we could use some input from you guys so if let us know what you prefer like in the comments or in our group like do you prefer uh, it in the anus or like maybe what come on quirky I'm being serious here that's uh, exactly. we have so in the, the comments or in the, the group or if you want to that question what continue for fuck's sake <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, let us do, know do, in the do, comments or us. the group page or if you want to send us a message like if you guys think that a short podcast is better or longer ones or midway ones, you know. Ta -da. Or if you or if you disapprove of Luis's inappropriate relations with goats, you know. I just talk about goats. We've already clarified that a lot. you guys bring up goat fucking. I've never said that. You've never said it, but we've said it. And we're, we're we're kind of like Fox News. Everybody just believes <laughs> everything we say. Okay. Everything's true yeah, on the internet, enough. right? <laughs> everything but... we say is law. Wow, then this world is fucked. Sorry, that's that's some of the North Korea coming into me. I'm used oh, okay. to being a totalitarian. Hey, are there cunts in North Korea? <laughs> 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 Come on! <laughs> wow! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Shout uh... out to bleeping <laughs> we could do we could do like a um a counter like the ebola thing i'm gonna laugh if we get like one view from north korea and it's just kim jong-un and he's like motherfucking americans and it's actually the one uh, it's actually just kim jong-un <laughs> he's a fan of I, us I am sorry, and then he'll ask for an interview Praise be unto with him. us oh man but yeah uh, red versus blue season what? 13 i'm excited for that I am super excited. I cannot wait. Yeah, I'm st I'm so stoked for it. I'm gonna that... need to get my uh, sponsorship back up and running for that. Oh, I got my sponsorship. Oh. That's what I'm doing Tuesday night is watching Red vs. Blue. Yeah, mine is <laughs> Tuesday. Dead. Oh, I should rewatch the last season. That would be a good idea. Yeah, I've it's been on listening... YouTube. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I... um, on Netflix, I believe. Netflix, I think uh, they no, only have the Blood Ruby Gulch. Is. Oh, really? Yeah, no, no. Red vs. Blue is on YouTube or Netflix. I think it's just the Blood Gulch trilogy or oh, saga, okay. though. It doesn't. It doesn't go into like after that. So, but I mean, you know, Blood Gulch is still good. Classic, yeah. Classic RVB. You know, you got you got some caboose running around killing people for no reason. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I've been listening to all of the music, like, cause that's what I love about like m what I really like about Red vs. Blue. I've been just listening to Trocadero on repeat. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I don't listen to most of their stuff, but I mean, I like some of it. Like, I like the theme they did for this last... I don't know if they use the same theme for each season of the... Yeah. Um, the like, the what what are they calling this new trilogy of seasons? Uh, the uh, Chorus Trilogy. trilogy. Yeah. The planet. I think they've been using the same theme song. It's uh, Contact, I think. I really like that okay. one. Yeah. yeah, the whistling. I was about to do that. I, I don't think I've gotten um, that that CD, but I've got uh, season six through ten. Like I really like those intros. Yeah, and then uh, the Agent Tech theme is probably my favorite thing from Red, uh, the Red vs. Blue soundtrack. A girl named Tex. Uh, no, not a girl named Tex. Uh, Agent Tex. 
the dun 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 dun. This place is filled with lean ladies. Oh, plus there's also Tucker's song. Oh, Donut the musical is also really good. Yeah, is that is that one actually? Away. Is that actually a uh, Red is the Blue one? Yeah, that is. I mean, it's yeah, in the album, the I guess, but by Jeff it's... Bre- it's by Jeff Williams, but it doesn't feature in the show. It's like a yeah. extra. Yeah, bonus. I know, I know, it doesn't feature. I was just curious. Cause it's kind of the, like the, the only place thing. it's uploaded is like some random YouTube account. Yeah, like it's not on any official for Yeah, that one. Something. They use it for some of their like outros. Well, yeah. we do, but it's nothing like yeah, I, during the show. You don't hear it. I used to yeah. wonder. I had to look it up when I first heard that on, I think it was an Achievement Hunter video. I thought it was Jack singing that at first. <laughs> me too. Let me blow you away. Yeah, because we all know Jack's uh, pretty, you know, leaning that way. Right. Like a needle, yeah. get lost inside your head. Just to be clear, that we're music, talking about the same Jack here, right? Jack Patello? Yes. Patello. Yes. Okay. No, we're talking about your brother. <laughs> Just, I mean... You you could make that argument towards him too. I'm just Have saying. you wondered? <laughs> no, yeah, I secretly think my brother is actually Jack Patillo. He he just oh, never mind. <laughs> he just magically appears in Southwest Florida, you know. But since every Jack night. is Jack, I'm is your brother Ryan? What? Oh, is your brother my God. Ryan? Well, I don't <laughs> have a brother. Are, are you telling me I have dum, a brother? Dum, 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 dum. And it's Ryan? Yes. Because now I'm scared. It sounds like Jack. Like, don't psychopaths normally kill their brothers? Nah, what? I don't think that's a rule. What if they don't have brothers? Well, that would be awkward. Actually, I don't even, like, hear them with the same voice anymore. Like, I yeah. they sound completely different now. Yeah. I think I it was think just we, in the beginning. Yeah. People can already tell the difference by now. Yeah. Like, uh, Bernie posted, uh, it was like a short little video uh, that was kind of old. He put Ryan and Jack's beard and... Ryan tried to sound like Jack, and it just didn't sound the same. Yeah, it was weird. That yeah. that does doesn't sound the same anymore. They're not team same voice anymore. They're team almost same voice. Somewhat same voice. <laughs> Somewhat Barely same, same voice. <laughs> but he got pretty team close BS. Though. That's what they should be. Team BS. Barely same voice. Well, that could also mean team bullshit. Yeah. Actually, <laughs> that that's the idea, Luis. Or Bachelor of Science. That too. Or Big Scrotum. <laughs> sure. That way too. <laughs> Birch hit. Bat shit? Crazy. No, well, yeah, bat shit, sure, but I said bird shit. I know. Team yeah, I know. Shit. I heard you say bird shit, and I said oh, bat okay. shit. I'm just keeping the BS going, man. You gotta keep that Bullshit, BS going, Bullshit, bird man. shit, bat shit. Or BS shit. flowing? Too many, too many shits. What if Tyler had to bleep out all... Does Tyler oh. ever bleep out shit? No, or, no. I, I don't think he cares about that. Uh oh. <laughs> if he has to bleep yeah. out all the cuss words, that we would might be get flagged. In his job. Just, yeah. <laughs> all right, so, uh, questions? maybe now, yeah, I guess we could do some questions. All right, yeah, let's do some questy quests. Questions. Questions. I feel like that was slightly different. Yeah, it was a little lackadaisical. This yeah, time. yeah. Like, try, try that. Try that Don't again. <laughs> lackadaisical. <laughs> Give it another go, there, buddy. Old what? Chap. I'm not familiar with that, Sparks. To be honest. What? Lackadaisical. Oh, um, kind of slow and not really caring. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Da, da, I, I da, da, don't think da, I've da, ever da, heard that da, word before. Questions. Okay, oh, okay, I can do better, guys. Da 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 da. Questions. That's more like it. Yeah, I don't think I should be laying on my throat next time. <laughs> oh, that's probably a good idea. All right, just then. Imagine so... like your Adam's apple just pushing your entire body up three inches when you do that. Oh God. <laughs> I mean, unless you're, you know, not a dude, then that would be really hard to put on mm. on your Adam a- a- Adam's apple. Yeah, since you know. Yeah, I don't have one. Uh, yeah. yeah. Sure. So. Boy. <laughs> anyway, um, so this one was sent by Tyler. Seems to be Tyler. Oh, who's this no, guy? Oh, who yeah, I, he sent I, a lot of questions. I mean, of all of our fans, I would say Tyler is probably like my least favorite fan. I mean, he Aww. does like absolutely nothing to contribute to this community. Is, 
Is that such a Tyler, throw Tyler under the bus episode or something? Because he's not even here. <laughs> Every episode is Every episode throw Tyler throw under that, the that's bus. What, that's what we call Tyler's spring break is uh, throw Tyler under the bus time. I mean, used to be a time when Vic uh, was able to be on the podcast more often, and then it would be like every episode is throw Vic under the bus, but then we had to use Tyler because she's, like, ultra busy with work. Ah, uh, gotcha. But hey, she's, when she's the two of them get together, it's like, it's like a bus station. Just buses all the fucking yeah, time. She's, she's, she's coming back when we start doing the uh, video podcasts. It's like, it's like right, they, Tyler, they have slingshots, just and they're just, they're just slinging buses at each other. Um, but questions. So, uh, Tyler's question is: You discover that the world is ending, and it's ending very, very soon. You get internationally broadcasted to the entire world for the last minute of humanity's existence. What would you say in that last minute? Oh, f- really? Um, I would honestly say that I would, you know, assuming that the internet's still working, or maybe I'd plan ahead for it. You know, I would probably bring up um, either my immortal, and I would recite that, <laughs> or <laughs> wow, <laughs> or or um, Shrek is love, Shrek is life. Either one you know, of those. Some people one. remember uh, like, <laughs> some very shitty stuff, and they're like, "Yeah, the world's ending. That that shouldn't be so bad, I guess." <laughs> and it, let, let's assume that like it's being broadcast on TVs and like Megatrons and Times oh, Square and no. stuff like that. Oh, I would, I would, like actually have it put up on the screen for people to read how awful it is why would you do that i don't know what's worse like the world ending or being forced to like watch the you know watch shrek's look shrek is alive or my mortal (laughs) uh, at the last minute of my existence you know right (laughs) before the world ends the two things are a- very shitty. <laughs> <laughs> I can just imagine you like watching me on your TV and you're like, God damn it, TJ. And then we're For all vaporized. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I have what no I- idea. Oh, God. Um, I would probably put them down and teach them about human anatomy through the wonders of internet porn. <laughs> wow. wow. Okay. Uh, I know what I would do. I just broadcast, it's peanut butter jelly time, peanut butter jelly time. Wait, yeah, wait, yeah. 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 The yeah. ironic thing yeah. is the world is no, actually about to go. get like there squashed between a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I actually think I know <laughs> what I want to do. I would sing, um, it's the end of the world as we know it. <laughs> it's the end of the world, the world as, we know, as it. we know it. It's the end of the world whoa, as whoa, we whoa, know we it. Whoa, 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 we can't say that. No shit, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> It's a cover, it's a cover. It's a cover, but... it doesn't matter. It's okay, there's no music. We're not trying to sell it. We are a non-for-profit We're not channel. We're this. Please, YouTube, don't fuck us. What? At least okay. buy us dinner first. YouTube, oh my god. <laughs> Tell us we're pretty. <laughs> YouTube, please. Maybe, maybe a couple of lavish clips. I got my own channel with Smite gameplay. This doesn't, this doesn't need to reflect on that, right? Right? Sure. Maybe. Anyway. Anywho. Now that that awkward silence is done. Yeah, Next I was question? adding the question. I'm sorry about that. Gosh, Luis. Doc, Gotta be the bird, man. Uh, okay, so... This one was sent by Sunny88P, and he asks... Is that wait, I'm actually trying oh to God. pick and a he asks. question here. Okay, so his, his question is, if you were invited to a gangbang, would you accept? Oh, Jesus. Depending who's there. I, um, <laughs> yeah, I'd probably go with Quirky's answer, depending no. on who's there. If it's a bunch of Irish people, eh, maybe. Wait, Irish people? Average. Oh, but you said Irish. I'm like, why Irish people? Because <laughs> they'd be, because they'd be top of the board in Ontario. It's like they're all smiling and like you know talking in their Irish accents while it's happening. <laughs> oh, that's a bit racist. Never mind. I can say it because I'm born in Ireland. I was from Irish descent. That counts, right? I mean, sure. I'm from Irish yeah. descent too. Yeah. Hey, Corky, we're related. I'm not. Kind of. Oh my god. Plot twist, Quirky's your brother. Whoa. Duh! Quirky is Jack? Oh, God. That means he's actually Ryan, so... That... Whoa. So Quirky is Jack, but he's actually Ryan. 
Either way, Quirky, I can't have you on this podcast. That is unacceptable. Why? Because Jack can never be on the podcast. I mean, if he says the word poop bike to you, that's was a it code. poop or was it some other? It was poop bike. Oh, poop bike. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, you, got, you gotta you gotta poop. remind me every every episode from now on, so I, I'm keeping my ear out for it. <laughs> oh man. Of course, you'd be keeping an eye out for the poop. No, not I'm not keeping my eye out. Quirky, why are you confusing senses again? <laughs> it's like I'm keeping my eye out. I'm staring at his mouth, waiting, waiting to lip read him say "poop bike." But yeah. uh, wait, did you all answer the question? No. Well, <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't want to go to it because I wouldn't think I'd be on the giving end. Uh. uh... If you know what I mean. Sort of. <laughs> no, a gangbang. <laughs> Maybe. Well. No. Okay. I'm trying to think of some <laughs> way to, but I, we're, that we're question all really trying off. to be. Like, I, I just picked the beginning, and the the I sentences. kind of found out the rest of the question <laughs> as I was reading it. So. Okay. Yeah. Uh, fuck. Good job. So. I mean, if the there next are, question. Yeah. yeah. Sure. Uh, and I don't think, I mean, mm. I think, I think let's just move on to the next question. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, that's, so you're telling me you wouldn't a go to a goat question. Bang, bang, so I'm going to answer pancakes. There you go. <laughs> now you can, an acceptable answer is also 42. Yeah. Like take that as you will, you know, pancakes. <laughs> you take it. If I were invited to a gangbang, would I accept it? Pancakes. There you um, go. <laughs> like, is that what you say to the person? They're just like, what? And no, that's Pancakes. not a password. That's no, no. Just sh- <laughs> shut up. It's like, oh, you got the magic password. Come but on, good job. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right then. It's okay. Sparks. Do you guys want to do be one on the more? Receiving end too. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's good. do one more. I mean, since we really don't have Tyler in the podcast, I think we can ans- we can use another question of his. Yeah. Sure. Because he's in right the podcast then. a lot, so. Yeah. So, Tyler asks, you believe we've come across a way to freeze time, but how would you test it to be sure? Hmm. Um, how would I test freezing time? Well, I would start by freezing time. But then, like, oh, I would, I would be around people. Like, how would you test it? I mean, you could literally test it doing anything, couldn't you? Yeah, like, no. Like, the, you know, go walk outside. It's like, pause time. Oh, look, everything stopped. Yeah, I mean, people well, it works. stopped on their tracks. You know, they're not walking. They're just mid-walking, but stopped. Yeah, I guess. So. I would go Actually, around hum- hummingbirds. Oh. Yeah, that would be interesting. Mm. It's, it's, oh, the, it's like uh, slow-mo, guys. But yeah. stop, Mo guys. Have they done hummingbirds in slow mo guys? No, uh, I don't think so. I, mean, I don't I, think they have. That's a good idea then. Yeah. I would test it by uh kicking someone in the dick. And really? yeah, I mean if the person doesn't even flinch, then time is stopped. And then I run the fuck away and observe from a distance. That's kinda like uh I think Something like that would happen in that movie with Adam Sandler, uh, Click. He pauses time, his left yeah. his boss's face across a fuckload of times. I think there's something about kicking someone's So you would too. be like Adam Sandler? No. No, I that's... I'm disappointed. Oh, please. No, that's not what I said. I said I'll kick someone in the dick, but, you know. No context. The person might have deserved it. In the it. dick or in the balls? I don't know. Both. Well, you know, it's all there, TJ. I mean, <laughs> we we own. Uh, the foot is bigger that than stuff, like that so... area. <laughs> so just aim for the you general know, area. Yeah, I mean, if if you kick it, you're gonna hit both things: balls and the dick, and everything else. So yeah. Mm-hmm. Shout out to a uh, little lesson of human anatomy on the podcast. We are also. Uh, we are. Very... We are the politically correct biologists. Yeah. Yeah, you're I, politically I'm sure correct. <laughs> I'm, 
I'm PCBs. absolutely sure that when you clicked on this podcast, you were not expect, uh, expecting to learn about the male genitalia. And now you have. So you're welcome. I have heard way too much about male genitalia this week. Oh. Um, care to elaborate? DJ, DJ nope. finally got laid. J- just going to leave it on that. Whoa, male genitalia, but wait. Not DJ... like that. Like it's, I said, DJ it was a I conversation. Got laid. It was ironically a uh, class conversation between our class and our teacher, but let's... Oh, that's awkward. Yeah. Was Genghis Khan involved? No. <laughs> was Genghis I mean, I mean Khan my teacher naked? kind of looks like a little bit like <laughs> Genghis Khan if he were Asian, but no. Interesting. Well, that, uh, mm. that got awkward fast, so... Mm. <laughs> Quirky made it awkward. Quirky, we'll blame why? The Quirky. Why would I Quirky, make it please. awkward? I would make why would it you awesome? make it? Hmm. So... Uh, so quirky doc, you guys want to fight to death to see who can ask the question for the audience? Hmm, who would win? Wait, my my vote's on uh, my vote is on <laughs> I Man. dare you to step in Australia. I oh, okay. Hey, Damn. hey, my vote is on Page Man. I'm just gonna say that. Vote, vote Whatever, on Page. Jack. <laughs> I vote for what was the my sloth army? <laughs> but your sloth army isn't in the fight. It's Quirky versus Sparks. TJ, the there is one thing you should learn. My sloth army is everywhere. We'll we'll conquer the world eventually. <laughs> you, you're hey, you're going to be the this one. Oh be my the god, sloth version of North Korea. <laughs> run, run it's away like, very slowly. <laughs> they're coming, really slowly, but they're coming. <laughs> we'll slash oh. the shit out of our enemies at some it's point. Like, <laughs> it's it's like a really bad horror movie. <laughs> It's like you're you running away it... and you're tripping yeah. every three feet, <laughs> yeah. and they're just slowly coming. But yeah, okay. So uh, I guess. who wants to ask the question? You guys have anything planned? No. Oh, no. Um. So you don't have anything planned? Who would planned? win in a fight between me and Doctor Sparks? There you go. That's <laughs> the answer of the audience. I thought that... they thought that was a question. <laughs> yeah. Who would win in a fight between me? And Dr. Sparks. And then what would their question to the audience be? B, <laughs> yes. That's a double. There we go. Double whammy. Two people, two That's questions. That's way too meta to be a Bow question. Bow wow. Like oh, meta okay. meta. So now you're putting rules on these? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, Joseph Stalin. You got me. <laughs> Quit Stalin. God. Fucking God. All right then, so fight who will the win in a, in a fight between Doc and what? Quirky? Let us know in the comments or our group page and all that. Let us know. Uh, don't worry, Jim will tell you how. I'd like some lettuce. The sugar. That, the chupacabra. Is, is it going to be Jim again? Uh, oh, yeah, Jim, still the outro guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. We need to get him back on the podcast. And now, some word f- and now a word from our sponsors. Are that you <laughs> paying too much for car insurance? Go to quirkyscarinsurance.com. Where you'll find the most quirkiest price ever. <laughs> do you have... Cars.com. Do you have actually cover problems? any cars and he's not a licensed practitioner. Do you need a lawyer? <laughs> well, you do now, because now you, can hire, you, now you can hire this great southern lawyer who is known for being able to protect you from many sorts of crimes. Now, you see, my client here, while it does appear on the videotape that he did, in fact, run over that picnic of squirrels, he was actually that was trying to skills. drive his pregnant poodle to the vet. Aww. Unfortunately, the poodle was run over too because. What? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where I was going with this, that. This commercial went <laughs> way south. Do you have he problems you following instructions and usually get your, your dick stuck in the ventilator or the blender? <laughs> well, fear no more. <laughs> Maybe it's just Luis. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes it's a ven- sometimes it's wait, a wait, wait. Sometimes if it's you a call one eight hundred, we can tell you I'll exactly every how to, to find out what your dick from objects. Blender, <laughs> your car ready? exhaust, and Pele, <laughs> and ready, and Pele comes on. I call. Talk to your doctor. Call I would. Like the guy. I would. They just pull up in a van with a huge pair of scissors. Problem solved. <laughs> <laughs> you hear from our very satisfied clients. That's- yeah, I no. tried installing my TV, and you could say his business I got is on my the cutting edge. Stuck, uh, in it. And now, uh, <laughs> after I called the 
unsucking service, my life's a lot better, and uh, my dick is kind of okay, I guess. Can't have kids anymore, but come you know, to the unsucking service <laughs> where we just and my get TV the is tip. working fine. <laughs> come, come to the uncleaning service where we get just the tip. Just the tip. Work. That's like the. Oh my gosh. This Don't quit so your day good. jobs, guys. So, is this the Easter egg, or are we? Did we already wrap up? Uh, we haven't ended yet. <laughs> oh no, uh, we have to wrap up. So, everyone, thank you so much for listening. Doc, Quirky, thank you guys so much for being here. Yep. Hey, thank you, thank you, fine hey, gentlemen Tyler. and gentle ladies. Tyler, you big and fat. Yeah, I can't say it. He's not. Oh. Bad. Hey, then. Uh, don't forget to listen to the outro to find out how to interact with us. And it's Jim. until next week, don't get your genitals stuck in blenders. Or Otherwise, you'll just get whatever else. Also, if you need a fine southern lawyer, feel free to contact me at notalawyer.com. Bye. Oh my Bye. <laughs> Bye. Just a beep. Tip. Oh. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. Thanks for listening to the Shifty Key Podcast. The intro and outro music is provided to us by our editor, TDB Tyler. To get more involved with the Shifty Key Podcast, you can answer the questions for the audience asked by our guests, or even ask the cast a question of your very own, either here in the YouTube comments or in our Rooster Teeth group. To keep updated with this channel's shenanigans, you can follow us on Twitter, join and watch our group on Rooster Teeth, or simply subscribe. All links will be in the description. Until next week, goodbye. What the fuck is that beep? Beep, beep, beep. Did it actually sound like a beep? It does if you beep. think hard enough. <laughs> beep. Brain's going into overload. Oh god. <laughs> is it a bunch of loud beep. clicking noises followed by a series of whirs and zips? Yes. No. Oh. TG, okay. Why? Because. Just, just let it happen. Just, just let it happen. Do. Oh, shut up. Ah. Oh my god. What's everybody doing today? Uh, I'm procrastinating. Games. That's about it. Yeah. <laughs> you know how like, like shit tons of stuff to do, and all I want to do is play video games. Yeah. Yep. Uni. Yeah. Sometimes I don't even want to play video games, but I just don't want to do my work. I mean. I don't yeah. think I have uni work to do for this week. So I'm okay for also, now. Happy Easter, guys, because this will come out. Oh, on yeah. Easter. Oh, yeah. Good right. oh my gosh. We could totally forgot about Shout that. Shout out to Easter. Wow. Happy bunny episode, everybody. I hope you all get your faces stuffed with chocolate. And if you can't eat chocolate or you don't like chocolate, then stuff your faces with starburst. whatever else. The starburst and let's not the forget best. the true meaning of Easter. The Easter yeah. Bunny died for our sins <laughs> and rose again in three days. Wow. Wow, mind blown. <laughs> Fun fact, the Southern Lawyer killed the Easter Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, not the Southern yeah. Lawyer. His client, the Easter his bunny. client Full circle. killed the Easter Bunny. His client killed the Easter Bunny, but he, the <laughs> Southern Lawyer to... tried to get him off, but failed oh. because he sucks. Because he's not a lawyer. <laughs> not a lawyer.com. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh oh man oh by the way uh, I need to clarify something actually correct myself I think it was Tyler who mentioned a while ago when we were talking about Assassin's Creed or maybe it was you TJ that at some point Arno said requiesco te pace uh, what? Yep. yeah he actually says that but it's on the Dead Kings DLC Okay, yeah, he must have said it like towards the beginning because I accidentally started that, but I realized it was kind of after the story, so I didn't start it. Yeah, I like stopped. I, do you? By the way, no, spo- no sing, story spoilers because I'm still working on finishing it. Oh no, that's because... okay. You know what I what I did? Uh, where are you in the story, like sequence wise? Uh, see, I'm on sequence twelve. Like I'm well, about to, I'm about to go on the hunt for Jaman. I was in sequence forward. six. And I started the Dead King's DLC accidentally. You know what I did? I reset the whole thing.
These men must never know <laughs> my identity. That was so frustrating. Wait, you reset the whole game? Yeah. Why? Because I did. I didn't. I more. hate spoilers, dude. I didn't want so to get you just leave. You just leave. That's what I did. I just went back to France. My love. Went back to I Paris. couldn't do that. That's the thing. So, it, it didn't work for me for some reason. It doesn't. It didn't spoil anything. It just. Singing. So you were up to sequence six, and then you restarted the whole game, and then you finished it, and now you're starting Dead Kings again. Yeah, pretty much. Oh no, I was One sequence two, five. One more day to wow, I fiction. couldn't have done that. No Assassin's Unity just so frustrating. I am yeah, saying by the way, thanks for the background is... music, Quirky. Yeah, no, I, know. I, was, I felt like I was listening to two That's not distracting at all. Things. God damn it. <laughs> uh, well, you guys were talking about French Revolution. I'm like, huh, lame is. <laughs> yeah, there's actually a very funny side note by Sean Hastings. Yeah. In that game. In the, yeah. This is not that French Revolution. That comes much more later. Don't go looking for Jean Valjean. <laughs> He's not here. He's not here. All right. Well, if you guys want to continue the Easter egg, you can. However, I must go. I, know, we can go I actually do have stuff to do. So, so I probably should stop procrastinating. Yeah.